so this is the night before the book launch tomorrow. I've uh, basically got a hotel room just opposite from the building. So I can literally just walk to it first thing in the morning because I have to set up at literally eight in the morning. And I've got hair and makeup coming to my hotel room at about 6.30. So I really haven't got time to be traveling too far. Um, but just to let you know what I'm doing right now, I've basically put ketoconazole cream into my scalp. I did this a few hours ago. Um, just because I need to minimize my dandruff. That's really important because I'm trying to grow my hair and healthy hair needs a healthy scalp. So I did that before. Now I'm gonna jump in the shower. I'm gonna pop on my uh, microfiber towel um, and then I'm actually going to do my hair properly tomorrow. But just to show you what I'm doing right now. So this is what my bed looks like right now. Ta -da! <laughs> uh, and so I'm going to show you basically I've got uh, I've got lectures to do all day tomorrow so I'm I've written them all out and I'm practicing them literally every hour I've got a new thing I'm going to be talking about so the first one is for the press then the next segment will be on eczema and acne then the next segment's on hair etc so I didn't really think it through because I thought you know I kind of wanted to bring my book to life and so I thought let me do different chapters but I didn't realize how nervous and stressed I would be and the last thing I need is to memorize five different lectures <laughs> without any powerpoint without any you know handouts it has to literally just come from my brain uh so yes if you guys ever do a book launch I just recommend you memorize one lecture instead of five <laughs> top tip I'm going to show you how loud central London is I used to live in central London so I did medicine in central London literally down the road at ECL and I lived out for the whole six years and then after I got married I had a flat in central London and I've totally forgotten now that I live in the suburbs with babies <laughs> how loud central London is so just look at this that's what it looks like but it's basically just alarms and um, police sirens all night <laughs> So I'm not sure how I'm going to sleep. Um, but the other thing that I do is I basically look at the reels that I want to make the, ne the next day. So this is something I'm trying to improve is my reels. Um, it's not something that comes natural to me. Um, I'm not the most creative person in the world. So the way I do it is I, I look at other people's reels and I see is there anything I can teach that works with that particular music or that sound or, you know, the way the transitions work. And then I literally do write down the different angles that I need uh, to shoot my filming. So um, whether it's, okay, I need a transition for tomorrow from, you know, my pyjamas to my outfit. Um, you know, what's the good music? What was the lighting that I need? And what camera angles do I need? Do I need someone else to film it? Or can I do it by myself on a tripod? And I basically will write it out so that it's just less time of thinking. You almost want to be on autopilot on a really big day. And tomorrow is a huge, huge day. HarperCollins have gone all out for me. Honestly, this is not something that a publishing company normally does. You know, you're lucky if you get to sign a few books. Um, but they have really, they've put on a great show for us for tomorrow. I'm not going to give it too much away now because I want you to see how exciting it is, but I think you're going to love it. Okay, so we're just getting ready. First thing is, of course, I've put my Sarah Pet Brightening Moisturizer on, um, and then I'm going to put on my Inzinkable. So we're looking for a quarter to half a teaspoon for the face. Um, and this works as such a nice primer. So you'll see today, for example, I'm going to have full makeup on and my makeup won't move because, um, because this is... Uh, it basically creates a smooth layer across the skin and that's what sunscreen should be doing. It's creating that final coat to protect you from UV. Even though we're in the basement today, it is very sunny outside today, which I'm so happy about. Um, but just so you can see what it looks like, I can't actually see it properly because the light is literally shining bright, but it should give you a dewy base so that when you put your um, foundation on top, you'll have a dewy final look and always go upwards on the neck don't forget the neck and around the eye area really is key this is the area that ages the fastest such a beautiful day are you doing the actual makeup or the yeah the, okay let me just show you the angle then uh for eyeliner no for my um my yeah uh, like it quite yeah. high up yeah like I not might, i might wipe it a little bit and give yeah. you a bit more concealer yeah. underneath i feel like you look a little bit tired now. no i'm so tired Aww. I've got the, sh uh, the shape taped hard, like so good it doesn't oh, yes. move. Yeah. That's so nice to see someone else do your makeup. 
So hair and makeup is done. How cute is this lift? I'm just on my way down now. Um, so I don't think I've got time to go and have breakfast because it's now 8.30 and the doors open in one hour. And I need to make sure the collagen bar is set up. I have to make sure the formulation corner is all set up. I'm trying to stay calm. I'm trying to enjoy every second. And know that I'm very privileged to be in this situation. Yeah. And just praying that it all works out. Guys, so we are coming in. Look at my team, how amazing! <laughs> oh, this is going to be incredible. So, box after box after box. That's truly what basically putting an event on is. I'm going to take you down the stairs. So, is, are all the boxes downstairs now? Yeah, go down. So, I'm not exactly sure what's going on here, but this place is actually quite nice. <laughs> right, right now we're just doing the collagen station. So here we're about to make the collagen station. We've got the collagen powder. We're going to put them all into test tubes. See this? Look at this. We have a huge billboard. Like, it's literally like 10, 10 of this girl. <laughs> See this beautiful arrangement they've made. Look how stunning the colors. I love it. Well done, guys. It's amazing. Here we go, Hannah and Lucy looking terrified. <laughs> They're actually the first ones to start with the collet with our uh, making our facial oils. So here you go, guys. Look at the t-shirts. Skin revolution. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you suck it up. Correct. Yeah. So no, 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 no. All the way down. Yeah. And then you suck it up. And you only need how many mils? Yeah. Well done. Yeah. Same syringe. No, we're gonna have a new syringe. So glad. So this is the facial oil, guys. This is the recipe. There we go. And I've got the hemp seed going in. Amazing. Yes. Oh, I'm so glad. Wow. <laughs> okay, so we are very close to opening the doors. My mummy's here. Yeah, so proud. My glamorous mama. Oh, shall make I'm a place that. <laughs> so so proud, so proud. This is so exciting. Oh, I'm so Can you believe proud. it? I can't believe it. I'm in tears. So oh, so oh. proud. So, you look beautiful. <laughs> and we have Kasia. She's in charge of the formulation corner. And we're gonna be doing and this is in charge of our Hello. station. <laughs> I'm gonna show you. So excited. Okay, so here we have Chelsea from Pollen and Grace. I'm head of social, doing all of the content and behind the scenes today. Amazing. We're providing the grub. I'm going to show you. <laughs> so here we've got pollen and graces, our food bowls that are going out. How beautiful is this? Hi guys, I'm just freshening up now. Um, so I'm just putting on a little bit more lip liner, a little bit of eyeliner, and we're about to go in and do the next part of the day. Okay, so we're having our little downtime at the moment. Um, so it's basically, we've had three sessions. I've got two more sessions left to do. So I'll just show you what's going on here. Everyone's chilling a little bit. So here we are at the collagen station. So here, everyone basically gets to try a collagen. Um, and here are the cute little test tubes. And I thought it looked so nice because of the background. So I wanted to, to be reflected in our collagen drink. Uh, so that's going down really well. And here are the sachets that everyone gets to have. And then I'm going to take you over here. So this is the reading corner. We have the reading corner here. These are the studious ones. <laughs> so this is basically Waterstones. So Waterstones Gower Street is basically where uh, was my main bookstore because I was at UCL. And so we would be downstairs studying in the coffee shop downstairs. And so now Waterstones Gower Street is at my book launch. Can you believe it? So I'm going to take you through. Um, I do love this lighting, I have to say. It's amazing. And look at my billboards. We have a billboard. <laughs> <laughs> then we have a little billboard here, and I'm going to show you the team. They are chilling, so don't uh, judge them, but they are chilling on the floor in between <laughs> sessions. This is how we do Hi, Lavina! You're in my YouTube video now. Welcome. Yay! Lavina's here! Thank you. Thank you. Good excuse. Uh, yeah, I know. I heard. I heard. Oh my goodness. I'm going to take you to the uh, factory, basically. I've created a formulation corner over here. So here you basically collect your oils. And then you, you basically put your squalene in, then your hemp seed oil, then your, um, your jojoba oil, your hemp seed oil, and then your vitamin E. And you get these cute little pouches, so you get to go home with this. Ah, 
hand and made these and you can actually take these away with you to teach you how to make your own make safe facial oils so it's exciting it's been an amazing day we've had so many people come through it's honestly oh, incredible